Hi guys, this is MedTech 2014. Um, today I wanted to do a review on these pills that I've been taking. Um, they're called Longer Stronger Hair and Nails. It's got biotin, silica, and collagen in them. Um, and they're by the company Applied Nutrition. Um, the reason I got these pills, um, well first of all I've heard about biotin being good for your hair and your nails from my um, from a hairdresser because I said you know my hair is brittle like um, it's really straw like it's really dry no matter how much conditioner I use on it especially on the ends um, you know and what do you think I should do and she told me about this biotin so I was gonna get a long time ago and I never did but anyway the main reason I got these pills is because of the silica I've read online because I have this stuff that gets in my eyes and it's like white gunk, I don't know. Um, I went to the doctor and they've just said that it's allergies and I'm like, okay. But I've had this for months, you know, and they've given me allergy eye drops, they've given me antibiotics, because at first I thought it was pink eye. Um, but now um, I was going to take a silica because I read online that people said it's the only thing that works for them and I couldn't find just plain silica pills um, so I got these and silica is supposed to reduce mucus in your body and all that so that's how it gets rid of that stuff in your eye um, I've been taking it a couple days and so far it's actually been giving me more in my eye so I don't know if that part's not working yet or if it's getting rid of it maybe I don't know um, I guess I'll just have to take them longer and find out because some people said like three days and there was no more stuff in their eye I'm thinking that'd be awesome but it hasn't happened yet and I've been taking them for three days so um, this has also got vitamin A, C, um, calcium, zinc, copper um, and the silica comes from horsetail extract which is some kind of not a horse's tail but um, some kind of plant and it's got some other antioxidants from different fruits and plants like pomegranates. Um, but yeah, my hair, it feels nicer. Like, um, I got out of the shower the other day, you know, and I spray on my, um, I don't know what they're called. It's like olive oil, kind of, and, um... Dang, I can't remember, but I got it from the Dollar Tree. I did a review on it, and I used that on my hair to keep it, you know, not being so dry. I put that on it, and I blow dried it, and it just, you know, ended up like this. And I was like, oh, that's nice, you know, because normally my hair is so dry on the ends that I have to straighten it, even though I know it's bad for it. But I have to straighten it, otherwise it's just like, you know, and it's just bad. Um, but I've been using these and I feel like it's really been helping my hair. It just feels like soft and nice and um, more volume. And it's weird, I used some hairspray on my hair today and my hair just feels different with hairspray on it. Like it doesn't feel as like, or it doesn't look as oily and everything too. Um, but yeah, um, this has got three times the biotin, I guess, in other pills, which is 833% of your daily value, which I think is a little, a lot, but, you know, so far I think it's working. The only bad thing is I know it'll make your hair grow everywhere, not just your head, so gotta watch out for that. Um, like even my eyebrows, I feel like they were growing in down here, um, a lot, but, you know, you just take care of that, but. Um, and this part says more than just skin deep even the finest shampoo and conditioners won't fix hair that's starving for nutrients an expensive nail polish will only hide dull brittle nails that's because long radiant hair and strong healthy nails start from within longer stronger hair nails is nutrient rich complex that can help you achieve a natural vibrant and healthy looking appearance so and I do I, I um, cut my nails um, yesterday and I felt like they were harder because when I usually clip my nails, you know, they kind of break off nice, and these kind of didn't jaggedy, I guess, so they're, you know, they're not as brittle, they can just, it takes more to cut them. Um, it was weird, I bought this the other day at Walmart, and I had to say that I was 18, because I saw in the box it said not for under, anyone under 18, and I'm 22, so I was like, okay, that's fine. Um, 
but I didn't know when you checked out that actually asked you if you were 18, you know, and these are vitamins, so I thought that was kind of weird, um, but then I saw on the box that it said, um, oh, State of California Proposition 65, warning, this product contains an ingredient known by the state of California to cause birth defects or other reproductive harm. And I was like, is this going to hurt my ovaries? Like, I'm confused. Um, but I looked up online and it's because somebody emailed in on Amazon and said that, they emailed to the company and wrote on there and said that, um, and they replied back and said that it can have, since it's a bunch of natural different ingredients, you know, fruits and plants and biotin and all that, that it can have low levels of um, iron and, or no, lead, it was iron. I think it's iron. Well, either one, heavy metals in here because from the water that they get the, you know, natural plants and stuff from. So, and that's known to cause birth defects. I know this from my environmental health class, but heavy metals, you know, they go through the placental barrier. It's bad for your fetus because it can, you know, lead to different you know, it says birth defects and, you know, smaller birth weight, all that stuff. Um, but, I mean, I'm not pregnant, so I didn't think it was that big of a deal. And they acted like it wasn't in high concentrations to be a really big problem. Um, you know, it was just like minimal, you know, traces, I guess, but can still cause an issue if you're pregnant. So, um, but yeah, I like these so far. I think they've done good on my hair and my nails. Um, and I'm just hoping the silica works for, you know, right here in my eyes that I get the little, you know, not just eye boogers. Um, it's a lot of stuff. It's like, you know, stringy. That's why my doctors thought it was allergy related, but it hasn't gone away. I've had it for a long time. So I'm hoping the silica in these work to um, help solve that problem. So, okay. Thanks, guys.